as you know, Warthog Princess. Welcome back, and if this is your first time, welcome to my channel. Today's video is about the Diamond Foulard Travel Luggage. And what it is, is it's three pieces. You buy them separately. Well, if you want, you don't have to buy them all. I happen to like them, so I got all three. And the first piece that I'm showing here, this is the Perfect Companion Travel Bag. The pattern is called Diamond Foulard, and the material, the fabrication, it's not lighting up. It's kind of like the Preppy Poly, but a little different. But it's very like slicky. It kind of looks like a raincoat or whatever. It is padded, but not quilted. Um, but it is waterproof. So very nice there. I mean, if you don't do it in the water, that wouldn't. I mean, it's not gonna be like soakable, but it will definitely be wipeable and waterproof. So perfect for travel. Don't mind as much sticking it under the seat on the airplane, that kind of thing, because it is so robust. But very nice pattern, very nice colors. Of course, purple is my favorite, and then these nice blue and pink flowers. So really nice geometric pattern. So this particular bag is, like I said, perfect companion travel bag. It is very, very, very similar to the Weekender travel bags. It's about the same size and about the same construction with some slight differences. It's a little bit more simpler version. It doesn't have a lot of extra organization, but you'll see as we go through it just exactly how close it is. Starting with the rolled handles, of course, and it does have a removable, adjustable shoulder crossbody strap. It has the padded piece to help, and it's a nylon strap, and it does have metal fittings, which is nice. Um, it is a double zip closure for the main pocket. Zips all the way out. You can see the size of the bag, you know, quite large. The main pocket here um, on the back side has three slip pockets, just like the Weekenders, except it's not mesh. It's actually the black nylon material, same there. So the slips are actually made of that material as well, like double thickness of it. Then on the front side, it has two big slips. Again, just like the Weekender, except they're not mashed, they're that nylon again. So one big open pocket in the middle there in between. So very nice organization options. The front has one big pocket on it, so zips across. The tab on the zipper is that rubber tab, kind of like on the lighten up backpacks and stuff. And the, the name tag here on the front that says Vera Bradley, it is also um, rubber sewn in there. Um, this front pocket is just one big pocket. There's no special grommets or sub pockets or slips or anything. It's just a straightforward big bag. On the back, it does have a nice trolley sleeve and it doesn't have the zip or anything. It's just a sleeve. And then the two sides are slip pockets. There you go. So this is like your second carry-on, if you will. And it's once again very similar to the Weekender. All right. The next piece is the small foldable roller luggage. Again, it's in the diamond foulard pattern. I have this one already set up with the sides up, so I'll show you how to put those up and take them down in a moment. The small size is 14 by 20 by 9 inch, and it weighs about 5.2 pounds empty, and the capacity of it is 32 liters. Now, I don't really judge or um, estimate things by liters, but that was what the website says that capacity is in volume. So if that's helpful to you, then great. Um, they do come with a TSA lock, both of the rollers. TSA lock, a clear storage bag, and a five-year warranty, so that's great. They're not spinners, they are rollable, so they have the back wheels, so just a straight roll, and then they do have feet on the front part so that they stand evenly. Um, one note is to balance well pack the heavy stuff on the bottom of the bag and any of the um, more bulk down here because then it will stand up better because otherwise they kind of get a little wobbly if you put like the heavy stuff on top it just for some reason it's a little more difficult than a rigid suitcase to stand up straight if you don't pack it right so there's that let's look at the front of the bag the front of the bag has two pockets the first is this one right here just like on the front of the companion it has that little hood and it's a nice big pocket all the way down to the bottom. The next pocket has double zip on the top. I'm sorry, it's all I didn't hold it. So there's double zip, and it has gussets on the side, so it's like your top entry pocket for your quick access stuff while you're on the go. It does have a carrying handle on the top, 
and on the side. They're both well padded, good grippable, so you can maneuver the bag very easily. On the top, it also has the zipper closure for the extending handle for rolling it, obviously. Okay, on the back, it also has this faux leather Vera Bradley tag, which is your um, luggage ID if you want to use it for that. It comes with the tag and everything. And just slides back in discreetly in there. So that's it for the outside. The inside, so when you look inside, the top cover has this big mesh closure and so your big pocket all the way across. It also comes with a TSA approved lock and it comes with instructions how to change it. Um, if you look on the website right now, at least while these suitcases are available, it does have video instructions of how to change the combinations. I haven't watched it yet, but when the time comes, I will. Um, also inside, there's another pocket right here on the back wall. It's a zipper, it has mesh all the way across there and zips up. Nice and smooth zippers. It does have two um, of the luggage holder straps. This just has the cardboard, whatever paper on it from packing. Disregard that. I'll get this. Get the other one off. Yeah, it's like it was never there. Okay. So anyway, two of those straps, they are adjustable. You can do that. So right now the, the sides are put in the up position. So it's going to hold its form really nicely, which is great for packing it and using it. But now if I want to store it, there's three sides that you gotta fold in. So starting with the bottom, this bottom one is Velcroed on three sides. So I've already undone one. Here's the Velcro on the top, all the way across. It's pretty sturdy Velcro. So there's that piece, and then Velcro down the side right there, and then it just flops down on right here, okay? Next, you have the two side panels. Right here in the corner, I don't know how well you can see that. See that little corner thing right there? That's where you just tuck the corner of these in up here and it holds it, holds it in place. There is also a snap in the middle right there that assists. So you just pop it right out of those corners and it fall, falls right down into the bag. So you do the same thing on the other side and it's now down in the bag. See, so you have your two sides and your bottom piece right there. So you just fold that down. The bag just kind of folds in on itself in all directions. And then once you have it all folded up like that, you can put it in your clear vinyl storage bag. These are heavy duty. They have a handle on the top of the bag, which is great. So if they're standing on their ends, that's how I store them. You have it like this, like out in the garage. Or if you have it slid under a bed, it's a nice grab handle to pull it out. It's really nice. It does have a zip around the top. So let's put this right into its little bag and we'll move on to the large. So that's the small zip zip and off to storage. Okay. The large one is exactly the same except it is larger. So 17 by 26 by 11, it weighs 6.4 pounds empty. So still pretty light for a large suitcase and is 56 liters capacity. Same things that comes with the TSA lock, the five year warranty and all that stuff. Like I said, it is, it's identical setup, the same side, same or thing. So rather than running through that again, I'll just kind of put it back in the side for you. So big foldable, I do actually store the travel companion inside of this one. So I just fold that up so it's nice and flat and I put it inside right there and it's all flat. Get my handy dandy storage bag. and not so gracefully put it inside. So the large foldable slides right in and I have all three pieces side by side in the garage anytime I'm ready to use them. So.
plenty of space. You can actually even store other things in there. The bags are not like super tight fit or anything like that. So there you go. The foldable rollage, foldable roller luggage in diamond foulard. You've got the large, the small, and the perfect companion travel bag. Hope that was helpful and best wishes to you. Don't forget that Vera's birthday is coming up on August 9th. So there's a sale one to four August and it's 25% off everything. So hopefully some of the other things that are on sale now just in the like retired section, hopefully some of those will still be on sale and then you can stack. I don't know if they'll let you stack. They're being really tight about that, but best of luck, happy shopping and see you again soon. Bye for now.